Hey guys, uh, we got another of the Divine Altar events coming up in a couple of seconds. The first wave. Let's go to the left side, join the people who are already there. Already fighting the first wave. I'm not entirely excited about the first wave. Well, they die very fast. It's one hit if if I hit it well. There it goes, but even just for that you get 6600 experience, pretty good. But it gets really hard for those who haven't seen um, the other videos that I put up. It gets hard really fast. Another 6600. But I already want to prepare for the next ones. Let's see if I... There's still 58 monsters. So maybe I get another fight. There it is. Assaulter. Oh, that's already stronger. So that must be already... Yeah, that is wave 2. I actually bought a, an attack, a power potion, so I want to drink that after this fight. So let's do that right now. The reason I'm drinking this is uh, to kill them faster. Uh, let's go quickly. Power potion and a small defense potion. Okay. See if I can get into a fight. Nothing. 12 monsters left. 9 for wave 2. Wave 3 is about to come. 8. Look at all these people here. How many are we? 39 people. Not too many. But still good. Although I thought it would have more people. Okay, here comes wave 3. Come on, I'm just clicking all over the place just to get into a battle. Come on. There. And double attack. I totally forgot to double attack. So let's do that. Okay, let's have a look if any are left for that wave. They're actually making their way up. That's not good. If this wave has made their way up this far, that's pretty bad. pretty bad because this is still uh, an easy wave so I think we'll, ha we'll have a problem with the with the stronger waves they're all called assaulters but uh, well clearly they're a little bit different the next wave I think will already start killing my troops Wow, somebody already reached the altar. Okay, wave 4. Let's engage somebody quickly.
Delphic Destroyer straight off. I should get more attack things on instead of block, I think. I have a, an Astral which increases my critical damage. So I think I'll, I'll switch to that instead of my block. Looks like the left side is leaking a lot. He goes down. 26,000 experience. I'll quickly switch the Australs. Come on. Oh, got into battle too fast. Okay, Delphic. Yeah, like the advice given in the chat, if you're lagging in this event or another or any other events, uh, just restart your browser is because the flash player uh, takes more and more memory. So once in a while you need to uh, you need to restart. Okay, let's see. Um, I don't see the altar getting hit. Another 26,000 experience. Here we have six monsters left. Wave four. 13 minutes remaining. Onizuka leading with 4,500 points. I have 3,100. Let's switch that astral from the block to additional critical damage. So now I'll do a little bit more damage and I got the power potion so that's good. So waiting for the next wave and here on the right you have the bridge that you can pass to the other side. If you see that this side is already kind of saturated then just jump over to the other side. The next wave is here wave 5. I'm actually gonna stand a little bit higher to catch the ones moving up so I don't get stuck below and I see there are three monsters moving up here we go wave 5 has now launched an attack against the divine altar reading from the chat there So it's kind of like a whole series of little world bosses kind of a thing. Uh, some people in the chat having issues with other people but okay. It's kind of normal. Right side is leaking I hear in the chat so right after this one could be good to check that is if our side is fine that guy just healed himself for four and a half thousand damage and eight fourteen thousand critical from me okay I got casting speed decreased Some people are calling for freezing the monsters already. That's one of the two powers that the guild leader has. 33,000 experience. Time freeze has been used. So for two minutes the monsters are frozen. Gonna run up. Oh, I can't. Got straight into another battle. The altar is getting hit. 
86 out of 100. So we they were hitting the altar already. Um, they're still hitting the altar. Even though we froze them, that means some of the monsters are kind of invisible-ish at the altar. And I'm not killing this guy fast enough. He's a really fat guy, a lot of health. See, 13,000 and he's still... That was just a little bit movement on his health bar. We used the Divine Altar Healing, restoring health with 20. But if this guy is already tough, well the next wave is even tougher. Okay. Finally, I'm done with this guy. I think it's something like 50,000 experience or so. Let's have a look. No, only 33,000. Still, it's good. Now, 10 monsters left for wave 5. Both powers have been used. But the good thing is that they are in the cooldown. Which means that when we need them, hopefully next time they will be ready. Okay, so just to have a quick look on the right side. It's a basically a mirror image map. And on the... There's a pack of people on the left and the right sides right at the monster spawn. And I guess some of the stronger people are up there at the divine altar. That's Mouse there on the Jaguar. High Commander. And here we have Sir Bob in a fight, Chiron, Ronin, Ronin just re-engaged that assaulter. And in this wave, I don't know if I'll get to engage the boss, but he killed me last time pretty easily, doing more than 8,000 damage per hit. So let's go with the regular guys. So that's wave 6 now. So he's going to hit much harder. Well not that 1000 is not the issue. It's his magic that's the problem. Oh this looks like a little bit weaker guy. So I must have had a kind of a boss character before or something. Because this one is going down relatively easy compared to the previous guy from wave 5. Still you do want to have like this kind of flexibility in your astrals to switch around. So if you really want to go all attack like I need now, I could switch my block astral to the increased criticals. Or maybe you have like all solid astrals and, and you can swap in a critic pl additional critical um, astral. So it's good to have that flexibility and it's not too expensive to get astrals to level 3. But even level 2 is good like um, the enhanced criticals I have now um, is plus 10% at level 2. And it'll cost another thousand experience to get it to level 3, which is approximately 1.2 million, I calculate. So I don't want to spend 1.2 million for these rare times I need it. I suppose I should have used the Delphic Destroyer, but I saw he was already getting hit. The altar is getting hit. Damn it. 76 out of 100. 70. I'm gonna try to rush 58 
both sides 40 something let's see if I can rush there and grab at least one of the monsters 28 come on come on and if I'm free maybe somebody else is free 28 and that one monster is walking let me stop that guy okay I stopped one guy hopefully the others stop the others I think we survived that because I don't see any more damage done to the altar this guy is hitting 4000 damage and he is he has a lot of health yeah, as just mentioned in the chat that there were not enough people to block all the monsters. There we did another healing on the altar, so we're now back to 48 out of 100. And I'm one of the last people with the fight uh, in inside a fight now. Delphic Destroyer in coming in 20 seconds. Three minutes left. And I think we have a time freeze, so we might make it. Okay. Actually, I think it's pretty good that I'm holding this guy for so long because the next wave is not starting, it seems, until I kill this guy. Yeah, I also noticed uh, people are mentioning the experience is less than yesterday. There are only 39,000, whereas in the video yesterday I got a lot more. So yeah, I don't know why it's less. But I finished that guy and, and now the wave 7 started. And we have 2 minutes 28. 2 minutes 22 seconds. If we can freeze for two minutes now, we're good. And so far, here are a couple of monsters getting through. I'll take this guy, seems closer to the altar. Assaulter. Their time freeze has been used, so we it could be that we made it. So the monsters are frozen for two minutes, but probably then the new ones which are spawning are not frozen. So, but if all we need to do is survive um, those two minutes. I have 100 rage but I don't have the Delphic Destroyer I don't actually mind to die Altar is getting attacked that's not good news 34 out of 100 down from 41, 27 out of 100. I don't know which 20 out of 100. I hope there are some players at 6 out of 100 and 0 out of 100. We failed again. That's not good. That's not good at all. 
We haven't figured out. There must be some invisible monsters. So they're passing through. So in here there's some kind of a bug. So the game freezes. So I have to restart. And the chat people are just discussing to start immediately the freeze or not. So let's get back in and see what's what's going on. Can never hit these guys. My loading is too fast so it's lagging. All right, I'm back in and I have mail from the divine altar event with 3000 kyanite and three shadow crystals. That's actually less, it used to be five and five. So I'm not sure what's happening. Anyways, I'll take that. So thank you for that. So yeah, uh, less rewards. That's surprising. And can I get in the divine altar now? No. Event is now over. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. Press like if you liked it. Put um, comments if you want to help us defeat it. Um, and that's it. Thanks.